Take the example of Irbad ibn Sariyah radiallahu an. One of the poor companions, he lived inside the masjid. And one day the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he's collecting wealth from the people. So Urbad ibn Sariyah, he comes to the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and he says, Ya Rasulullah, you know I only have two garments. You know I only have two garments. I give you my top garment, please let me keep my bottom garment. Meaning he didn't want to expose himself. And he sits down next to the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and hopes that as people are coming into the masjid, someone will give him charity so that he can give it in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But as people are coming into the masjid, they're giving their money directly to the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And a time comes where Arbaad ibn Sariya, he gets up crying and walks away. The messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam didn't preserve this incident for us. But rather this incident is preserved in the Quran. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala goes on to say, وَأَعْيُنُهُمْ تَفِيضُ مِنَ الدَّمْعِ حَزَنًا أَلَّا يَجِدُ مَا يُنْفِقُونَ That their eyes flooded with tears. Their eyes flooded with tears as they walked away. Why? Not because they were asked to give and didn't want to give. That wasn't the reason. But rather these companions, they were asked to give and they couldn't find anything to give. And this made them cry. That Allah gave them an opportunity to help people. And they wanted to help, but they had nothing to give. They had absolutely nothing to give. 